the Sony A6900 is one of the most talked about upcoming cameras in the mirrorless world. Many photography and videography enthusiasts are eager to see what Sony has in store for its APS-C lineup. Rumors suggest that the Sony A6900 will be a major upgrade over previous APS-C models, bringing new features and improvements that could attract both photographers and videographers. While Sony has not yet confirmed any details, leaks and reports provide a glimpse into what we can expect. In this article, we will discuss the rumored design, performance, features, and possible release date of the Sony A6900. The Sony A6900 is expected to feature a design similar to Sony's full-frame A7C, making it more compact and travel-friendly than traditional DSLR-style mirrorless cameras. This could be a significant advantage for vloggers and content creators who prefer lightweight and portable gear. One of the most exciting design rumors is the inclusion of a fully articulating screen. If true, this feature would allow users to flip the screen to different angles, making it easier to frame shots when recording videos or taking selfies. This would make the Sony A6900 an appealing option for YouTubers and social media creators. Another potential improvement is the enhanced grip design. Earlier models in the A6000 series had smaller grips, which some users found uncomfortable, especially when using larger lenses. The Sony A6900 may address this issue by offering a more ergonomic grip, making it more comfortable to hold during extended shooting sessions. Additionally, reports suggest that the camera might feature dual memory card slots, a first for Sony's APS-C lineup. If true, this would give users more flexibility when saving files and provide extra security for professional photographers. The camera may support both SD cards and CF Express Type-A cards. CF Express Type-A cards are significantly faster than traditional SD cards, which could be beneficial for handling high-resolution images and videos efficiently. Durability is another area where the Sony A6900 may see improvements. It is rumored to feature a weather-sealed body, making it more resistant to dust and moisture. This would be a significant upgrade for photographers who frequently shoot in challenging outdoor environments. One of the most exciting rumors surrounding the Sony A6900 is that it will feature a 40.2 megapixel APS-C XMOR sensor. If true, this would be a major upgrade from the 24 megapixel sensors found in previous A6000 series cameras. A higher resolution sensor would mean sharper images, improved detail, and better cropping capabilities, making the Sony A6900 competitive with cameras like the Fujifilm X-T4 and X-H2. The camera is also expected to include Sony's latest Beyond XR image processor along with an AI-powered chip. This combination could significantly improve image processing speed, enhance autofocus performance, and boost overall camera efficiency. One of the standout features of Sony cameras is their autofocus system, and the A6900 is rumored to take it a step further. The camera may include 759 phase detection autofocus points, which would enable fast and precise tracking of subjects, including people, animals, cars, and even insects. This would make the Sony A6900 one of the most advanced APS-C cameras for autofocus performance. For action photographers, the A6900 might offer continuous shooting speeds of up to 11 frames per second with the mechanical shutter. Additionally, the camera is expected to have an improved buffer, allowing users to capture more shots in quick succession without delays. Low-light performance is another area where the Sony A6900 could shine. It is rumored to have an ISO range of 80 to 32,000, expandable even further. If true, this could allow the camera to capture cleaner images in darker environments without excessive noise. The Sony A6900 is rumored to include some impressive video capabilities, making it a great choice for videographers. Reports suggest that it may support full pixel readout 8K video recording at 30 frames per second. Additionally, it might offer 4K video at 60 frames per second, providing smooth and high-quality footage. For slow-motion enthusiasts, the camera could feature a 4K 120p mode, though some reports suggest there may be a slight crop when using this setting.
If these rumors are true, the Sony A6900 would be one of the best APS-C cameras for video, even competing with some full-frame models. Another rumored feature is an improved in-body image stabilization IBIS, system, possibly offering up to 8 stops of shake reduction. This would be a game-changer for handheld shooting, particularly in low-light conditions or when using telephoto lenses. The electronic viewfinder EVF, is expected to be a high-resolution 3.69 million dot panel, providing a bright and detailed view of the scene. Additionally, for photographers who need ultra-high resolution images, the A6900 might include a pixel shift multi-shot function, which combines multiple images to create a single super-high resolution photo. This would be particularly useful for landscape and product photography. The camera may also feature improved color science and dynamic range, allowing for more natural skin tones and better highlight and shadow detail. Sony could also include updated picture profiles and support for S, Log3 and HLG for more flexibility in post-production. While there is no confirmed information about battery life, the Sony A6900 is expected to use Sony's Z-Series battery, known for its long-lasting performance. This would be a significant improvement over previous A6000 series models, which had smaller batteries with shorter lifespans. For connectivity, the camera may include USB-C charging and file transfer, along with Wi-Fi and Bluetooth support. These features would make it easier to transfer files and control the camera remotely using a smartphone or tablet. Some rumors even suggest that the A6900 could have a wired LAN connection, making it a strong choice for professional live streaming and studio setups. Sony has not officially announced the A6900, so there is no confirmed release date. However, industry insiders speculate that the camera could be announced sometime in Q4 of 2025, with a possible release in the first half of 2026. As for pricing, rumors suggest that the Sony A6900 could be priced between $1,800 and $2,000. This would place it in the same range as the Sony A7C. Given its rumored features, this price point seems reasonable and could make the A6900 a compelling option for both professionals and enthusiasts. The Sony A6900 is shaping up to be an exciting camera for both photographers and videographers. If the rumors are accurate, it will feature a high-resolution sensor, powerful autofocus, excellent video capabilities, and a more ergonomic design. The improved grip, dual memory card slots, and in-body image stabilization could make it a great choice for professionals and hobbyists alike. Of course, since these are just rumors, we will have to wait for Sony's official announcement to confirm the details. However, based on the information available so far, the Sony A6900 has the potential to be one of the best APS-C mirrorless cameras on the market. Stay tuned for more updates, and let us know what features you're most excited about in the Sony A6900.